Hey guys, it's Kennedy and today I'm going to be showing you guys the stuff that I just got from three places. Um, yeah, clearly you're aware of my absence or not. I don't know if I came back yet or not. But this weekend I am vlogging like my weekend because it's going to be a really fun and eventful one. So I'm really excited for that and you know, life is about making memories so why not document them? Also, um, update my hair. I've dyed it. It's been like this gingery brown color or whatever for the past like month and a half. So, FYI. Okay, so we went to the beauty supply. And then I got this Eco Styler alcohol free crystal gel. It was $129. Uh, I got strawberry um, lip gloss because, you know, that's cute. You know, you gotta have your lips looking good. And then we got some gold accessories and these beads. I'm gonna make a choker. And then I got stuff from Target and it's basically around my skincare and stuff because I need to get it together because my skin is like so sensitive and it's dry. So I need to take care of it. Um, so I got Radiant Skin St. Ives body wash it's pink lemon and mandarin orange and i'm excited because it smells super good and then i got this nevia cream it's 89 cents it was 89 cents and it's like a daily moisturizer which i definitely need and then i got some aveeno baby eczema therapy nighttime balm because my skin like i used to have bad like eczema on my like hands and back of my legs like when I was younger but then lately I think it's like stress or something I don't know why it was stressed when I was younger I don't know um but yeah I got it recently on my hand so I just got some night cream for it it's like it's pediatrician recommended so it's like good for babies and then I ran out of conditioner and I always use like the Aussie moist big bottle of conditioner but they didn't have it so I got the three minute miracle I used the Carol's daughter conditioner right now but I it doesn't have enough slip for me and I know that this will so and I know it's a deep conditioner but you know tomato tomato so that will work a lot better for me so yeah um I hope you guys enjoyed this weekend or did enjoy it I don't know what order I'm gonna put this in but yes I'm back for now um I'm allowed to be absent at my leisure anyway okay love you guys see you later Good morning, ladies and gents. We are currently about to hit the road, so I'll see you. Hey guys, so me and Lauren are currently in the car. We are waiting for mother to get in the car, but we are about to start driving to Austin. You may ask, why Austin? Well, let me tell you. Um, it's a nice three hour drive and we are going to see Post Malone. It is currently Saturday, June 16th and I'm so excited. If you don't know this, Post Malone, I love him. He's like my favorite artist ever. I love him. I'm so talented, etc. So I'm really excited and we're going to the Austin one because I got tickets, like better tickets for cheaper for less expensive tickets um, in Austin compared to the Houston show for a good seat. So I'm going to just show you guys our trip. We are staying at a hotel and we're going to get Liddy and it is currently like 8. So we are going to be driving and we're going to get there and check in and eat and have just a fun weekend in Austin. And I'm super excited to bring y'all along because this is a life experience. So I'm going to just um, show y'all and have it here for safekeeping. So I'll see you guys later. Bye.
some gummy worms that I got in Galveston the other week. Let's turn up the number on me. Because that was my lifeline. So good. And a nice little blue icy. Because I think that's everyone's favorite one. Good, good, we're about to eat things. Okay. Okay. Um, because he's a pull-out bag. Hey, hi. <laughs> uh, you heard this? Nice desk. Ooh, a nice little TV. This is a nice can separate the dance Oh, look at her. You can separate it. A cool mirror. This mirror is cool. I'm excited for that. Mm -hmm. Bed. Mm -hmm. Bed. That's cool. Um, Canes, the cane sauce that goes good, you know. Time to eat. Hey guys, so, um, uh, we are about to start getting ready for the concert, and I'm gonna do a little time lapse for y'all to see, and yeah. I would like to get to know. You guys make me feel super fucking special, man. This next song is about getting fucked up. Uh, Particularly via the way of taking shots. If y'all know the words of this
and gents, um, it's the end of the night, best time ever, I looked really messed up, um, I put my hair up, my makeup's a mess, so I'm gonna untake, I'm gonna take it off and show you, tell you guys what's popping. So, so, first concert I've been to, ever, so that was like amazing, I literally cried when I walked on the stage, if you don't know my love for Post Malone, then that just sucks for you. Um, yeah, a lot of people were drunk and high. That was cool, I guess. They're living their best lives, that was what I'm like. It was super fun. Got lit. Very great experience. I'm just so tired and my eyes are really sensitive. So, yeah. Ugh. Um, it was an outdoor, the uh, outdoor one, and it was, like, really nice, so that was really cool. Mmm. Mm, my face. My eyes just hurt so bad. Artists were like so good. Post Malone's so good in life. I love Paris now. That too. 21 Savage, he had the flu. Look at us. Um, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Um, there'll be more tomorrow. I don't know if I'll make it part two or whatever, but. I got so many clips from the concert and I was trying to enjoy it too, so I put my phone away in my fanny pack and it was just a really grand time. So, I'll see you guys later. Thank you for watching. Good night! <laughs>